Did you know that we can fully control our Android phones on PC? Writing a note, sending a message, even playing mobile games on your computer. All these are possible only if you had a small program. Hi everyone, welcome to Easy Home Tech. This is Randall. Today I'm going to show you an awesome program called Screen Copy GUI. Some of you might know that Screen Copy is a famous open source program that works on the command line which is not so friendly to most people. Well, Screen Copy GUI is based on that but more powerful. It has a friendly graphic interface with a lot of parameters for your personalized setting. Especially it supports wireless connection which means you don't need the USB cable anymore once you have Wi-Fi connection. Now let's dig in. Firstly we are going to download the program. Open Google in your browser and search SCRCPYGUI. Open the web page in GitHub. Here we need to download two packages. Scroll down. Find the basic package. Choose the correct version according to your computer operating system. I am going with the Windows 64 version. Click to download it. Then we scroll up for the GUI package. Click to download it. Go to the download directory and unzip the basic package. We can move it to the program files folder in case it might be accidentally deleted. Here we go. The next step is to add an environment variable. Open the setting from the start menu. Search ENV to open it. Select Path. Click Edit. Add a new one. Paste the path of the directory and save it. We can use the command line to test if the package is well installed. Type in ADB version and enter. It means the package works if you get this information. Then we can install the GUI package.
The default language is Chinese. We can change it to English via the menu. As you can see, here are a lot of parameters for your personalized setting. However for general applications, we don't have to change anything, just skip it and leave them with the default setting. Since this program works on a USB connection. So next step we are going to open USB debugging mode on our mobile phone. Please note that the steps might not be the same for different mobile phones. I am using me phone to show you the steps. Click setting. Find the UI version. Keep tapping. And you are in developer mode now. Find the additional settings menu. Now we can see the developer option in additional settings. Open it and scroll down to find USB debugging. Here we go. Enable it. Here we got a warning. Confirm it and click OK. Another warning. Accept it. Connect the mobile phone to your computer with a USB cable. Choose file transfers. Allow it. Open the GUI program and you can see that the mobile phone has been detected. Select and open the mirror. Perfect. Let's test it first. Edit a note. As you can see it is much faster to type in with the computer. Another note. We can also download games. Another awesome function of this program is the wireless connection. You need the IP address of your cell phone. 
you can find it in the Wi-Fi details. Type it in the box. Turn on the wireless connection. And now you can see that the mobile phone is detected via Wi-Fi. I unplug the cable so that we can make sure they are connected by Wi-Fi. Open the mirror. Here we go. The wireless connection will be a little delayed so it might not be great for playing games. Other than that it works as well as the cable connection. Thanks for watching. If you like this video, a thumb would be the best support. And welcome to subscribe my channel. See you in the next video.